Hello everyone, I'm Tresser44 and welcome to this Let's Play of Avernum 3. Last episode, we went out and found a couple towns that were besieged by the giants and killed a bunch of giants, including one random clan that I happened to find. We could kill a couple others, but hmm, why bother right now? Now, we found the giant's fortress. Let's go in and see what we can do. You move through the gate of the massive wall the hill giants have built here and come face to face with a bunch of guards. They saw you well before you reached the gate and they are ready to defend themselves. Unfortunately, they don't give up their defensive position to come and attack you. They just stand there, waiting for you to strike first. Attack! The hill giant guards, bored by long, tedious stints of guard duty, are more than happy to break the monotony by fighting some humans. Well, at least there's no shamans. So that's a plus. Yeah, 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 go on, finish it off. Thank you. And now, allow us to perform our own form of magic. <laughs> yeah, they, those walls are actually kind of annoying because it takes a while to get to them. Fortunately, though, we have mages. <laughs> and a fireball. And there we go. We are now in. And that's interesting. There's actually two passages here. Let's take a look at that other one. Oh, great. Three hill giant shamans. Oh, I can kill one of them. So there's that, at least. Ow. Ow, I can only hit six, but I can kill them all. So there's that. Oh god, no. Good god, no. Crap, I can't reach them. Crap. Kill them. Kill them now. <sighs> okay. Oh, we really need those coins. Okay. Let's see what this place is. This side is like. Looks like they might have shamans here. Well, let's attack. One shaman! That's not too terrible. One shaman is not too terrible. I don't know which one is... There's a shaman! Use force cage, but I don't think it worked. Okay, then. That gets rid of all the weak ones. Alright. Couldn't quite reach him. Ah, uh, damn it, the force cage worked that time. And can't really hit anything with it. Mm. That would be no point. Okay, I guess you can do that. I think another one of that. Damn it, he survived. Minor and arrow. That did nothing. But that'll kill him. There we go. Ooh, energetic herbs. Grab him. Grab them, Pollux. Thank you. Alright. This is interesting. Eastern Giant Valley. Interesting that the Giant Valley is separated here. Well then. I suppose we can start with the Eastern Valley and move from there. Well, let's take a look. Oof. 
Cave of the Giants. Humans who enter have none hope left. There's the Giants. I have an idea. And enter combat. You are at the entrance to the underground home of the Hill Giants, a network of massive corridors and chambers located in a region of considerable volcanic activity. The giants are humid and full of the smell. The caves are humid and full of the smells of sulfur and rank, unwashed giants. From inside, you hear the bubbling of magma, the chipping of stone clubs being carved, and the chanting of shamans. Bits of rubble and crushed basalt are everywhere, and there are a disturbing number of bone chips scattered carelessly on the ground. There are a lot of giants here. Yeah, you, you just need to do haste. And you need to do some healing. You are a shaman, you die. Oh boy. Fortunately, we can get through there safely. Right, you provide a bit of healing. I doubt they expected anything like this. Ha ha! Okay. That was just a fighter. Okay, we got this. Or at least we got the entrance. This is a big place. You can probably kill that one with a snipe. Hey, you can! Fantastic. Eh, uh, you know what? Save your energy. We got this. Get back here, you. You're not going anywhere. There we go. Is all of them dead? Oh, interesting. You smell fresh air here and see sunlight to the east. There's an exit here, concealed by a thick mass of trees and brush. If someone wanted to escape from here, this would be the natural place. Unfortunately, the uneasy terrain prevents a natural return. Hmm. Interesting. There's a passage down there. Ow, ow, ow. How did you spawn there? Black Ember. Hmm. I wonder if that's supposed to be one of the four clans. Well, let's take a look. I want to be your friend. Shut up. Oh, well, there's a number of passages that go down. Whoa, that is... Is that a giant chieftain or something? And he opened the door. Great. Yeah, I think that's a giant chieftain. You kill that one! Thank you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's a giant... Yeah, that's a giant chieftain. Oof, he's... Oh crap, there's guardians in here? That's not good. And the giant is immune to that. Great. Great. Uh, how about acid? You can provide a blessing. Oh yeah, that's gonna work. There we go. Well, that's a guardian chief who's dead. Got a bracelet. A shield ring. Bronze helmet. Nothing there, nothing there. 
Okay. You see the burial mounds of dead hill giant warriors. Little trinkets and bits of carved stone adorn the graves. You notice that the carvings are, while not valuable, quite detailed, especially considering how big and clumsy the giant's fingers are. Though the carvings are the result of a lot of hard work, the giants have not been as careful with the actual disposal of the remains. There are lots of stray mm -hmm. bones visible among the stones. Inside the box, you find some personal effects looted from a dead Empire soldier. They're grind with dirt and blood. They have little value to you, but they might mean a lot to the victim's family. Take it. Okay. Pick the lock. Oh! Looks like we found a survivor! You find a human prisoner, a warrior of the Empire Army. He's dressed in rags, but in good shape otherwise. He jumps up to greet you. A rescuer! Oh, I knew I shouldn't give up hope! Can I escape now? How long have you been imprisoned? I have no idea. I've lost track. I'm so relieved you're here. I was afraid I was abandoned by the Empire Army. Can you help me escape? Nobody else has come to try to rescue you? Who knows? The Empire has done so little good against the Giants, I thought there was no hope of rescue. Now that you're here, there's hope. Can you help me escape? We're not with the Empire. You get a skeptical look. You're not with the Empire Army? Then who are you? Oh, what does it matter? Just as long as you can rescue me. We've cleared a route for you to escape. Go. Oh dear. I have no chance of fr sneaking out the front gate, and I can't go below either. I'd get killed. Have you found some sort of more concealed way out? You describe the hidden brush-filled exit you found. Thank you. I may die sneaking out, but at least I won't just be butchered in this hole. He slips out of the chamber and runs for his life. Well, good thing we found that exit. Nothing much in here, it looks like. Hmm. There is an intricate carving of a flaming stone on this obelisk. Oh. Interesting. Oh boy. Eek, eek, get off there. Deathrock Clan. All heretics will feel our stones. Well, okay then. Okay, well we know about them in there. Let's enter combat. And charge in. <laughs> Nothing. Really, that's all there was here? I expected more. Eh, no biggie. Got a haste potion. Too many items! Fa. Fine. Give the poor that iron greatsword. Nothing in there. Inside the box. Ah, more personal effects. Take them. Nothing in there. Some coins. Quite a few here. Enter combat. Yeah, we got this. This won't be hard. There you go. Oh, we found their chieftain. Alright, spray acid. I mean, at least it's something. Okay. Arrow? That works. Yeah, that chieftain's gonna die. Fireball should help. Hmm, that one's actually vulnerable to the fireball. And now he's dead. So that's actually two chieftains dead. Vulnerability elixir. Tremor boots! That's interesting. What are tremor boots? Plus 15% levels of encumbrance, plus 1 to strength, plus 2 to hardiness. Plus 15% levels of encumbrance. That doesn't sound very good. Yeah, I'm not really a fan of getting that much encumbrance. I think maybe we should sell them. 
interesting as they may be. That looks like another passage down over there. Pick the lock. Hello. Die, die, and die. Alright then. What else we got? Disarm the trap. Healing potion. And disarm the trap. Energy potion. Alright. Pick the lock. Pick the lock. Ah! Another survivor. Clear a root for you. That's two es escaped survivors. Sadly, not one there. Oh, hello, ogres. Hmm. That's an interesting thing. Looks like a temple over there or something. Probably nothing of use in these. Flame Club Clan. We follow great serpents. Hmm. Okay, that doesn't sound too promising. Well, let's go in. Oh, hello. It's just a fighter. Quite a few of these now. Okay, enter combat. There are a lot of these guys here. As long as none of them are shamans, we're good. Didn't see that one. Eh, yeah. Hello. Ow. This is hurting a lot. Ah, come on! We were doing well! Okay, at least we know of that. Alright, provide a bit of healing, please. And enter combat. Yeah, there's a lot of giants here. Alright, how many of you can, can you kill with this? Stop that! Can't really kill any of them with that, but... Man, Smite is not as useful as I'd like it to be. Yeah, that one's dead. Ow. Yeah, come on. Right. One of these. Excellent. And... There we go. Okay. Grab some more coins. Ah! More effects. Excellent. Hi, I'm a talk. Shut up, I don't care. Okay. That's another path down. Oh! Hello! <laughs> didn't see that coming. And Carl almost died, I didn't even realize. Steel arrows, lightning spray, U bow. Don't think we need any of those. Still haven't found these. The, uh. Chieftain of this group. Flame Club. There is also the crude carving of a huge serpent. Hmm. Also, there's a passage over here. Is this just. Yeah, that's just a way around. Ignore that for now. Interesting. They didn't have a chieftain. I wonder why they didn't have a chieftain there. Is he hidden elsewhere or something? Oh, lights going out. Soul Death Clan. All hail the Naga. Oh dear. Well, we found the way out. What's in here? Pick the lock. What have we got here? Ah, another survivor. 
You can escape just to the east. Nothing in there. Okay. Alright, head north here. And combat. That works. Okay. Can you get that one? You can. Surprising. But I'll take it. Hey, you two don't need to do anything. We got him. There we go. Grab the coins. More regular giants. They're not as big a threat. Fine, kill that one. Thank you. You die too. There you go. Right, Teresa, more healing. Thank you. A couple great swords, rocks, and more effects. Fantastic. Okay. That must be their chieftain, who doesn't appear to be in at the moment. Nothing there. Oh, hello! You came out of nowhere. Okay, that one's dead. The thick mist and odor of rotten eggs in this hall make your eyes water and your ma fill your mouth with a nasty taste. This river must be fed by natural hot springs, heated by magma and hot gases. Thick mineral deposits form a crust at the edge of the water. That's uh, a soul death clan. Hello. Oh yeah, they got quite a few now. Hey, you know what? Enter combat. There you go. Pollux, you're hurt, but this should do something about those three. There we go. Alright, give some healing to South Pollux. There we go. Looks like that's the way back. Found their trash pit. Oh, where do you do come from? You were not there. None of you were there. At all. That's the way through there. It's like the only other thing to look at around here is the river and this little temple here. Well, let's take a look at the temple. Oh dear! Um, that's dangerous. Hey! Okay, that's very dangerous. Very, very dangerous. Alright, remove that, Nippur. Get back there. Uh, leave it for now. We'll come back. Why is he terrified? You should not be terrified! Okay, this should finish off the shamans. And after this, we're gonna need to run out and heal. Okay, we're good. Okay, that was momentarily terrifying. Oh boy. Oh, we got an emerald and a ruby. Okay. This is the hill giant's main altar, a slab of unadorned basalt covered with unsettling brown stains. Unlike the troglodyte shrines, this altar doesn't seem to be magical. The altar does, however, have a sharp-looking knife on the top. Also, a bunch of coins and other small, semi-precious stones have been left in front of it as offerings. Let me save before I try and take the knife. Okay. Does this knife trigger a trap? You gingerly take the knife and the coins. At first, it seems like nothing bad is going to happen. Then a small compartment opens in the wall behind the altar. There's a reddish gold egg inside it. Then the egg cracks and flames pour out. Oh. 
Oh, and we're trapped. What even was the dagger? Unidentified. Well, that happened. Okay, so before I take that, let me see if there's anything, any hidden passages around here that would allow us to escape. Because otherwise, we end up completely trapped in here, unable to get out. And it looks like there is not. Okay then. Only one other thing to do, and that would be... The boat. Throw the boat onto the bridge. I'm going to see what we can find. You want nothing? Row into the bridge. Row into the bridge. Ah, hello. Place a small shield. That we can sell. Row under the bridge, row under the bridge. And nothing down there. Row under the bridge, row under the bridge. I'll leave the boat there. Alright, let's get out of here, we need to rest. Right, resting. Rest again, I suppose. Polishing, getting the energy back. I want to see if the other one is actually any different, or if it is exa the exact same thing. It is... actually different. Oh, it's the Giant's Forge. Tell you what, we'll take a look at the Giant's Forge in the next episode. This is where we'll find Giant Spain. Should have gone here first. That'll be in the next episode. Till then, I am Chester44, that is Carl Nepor, Pollux, and Teresa. This has been an Avernum 3 Let's Play, and I shall see you all next time.